Hi all, I'm very excited that you are taking advantage of the WW Clinic Strength Training Plan. What I'm going to recommend that you do at the end of this workout is track your workout under WW Clinic Gym-Based Exercises so it can count towards your physical activity goals. Hi everyone, I am Justin, the fitness director for Weight Watchers Clinic, and I'm going to walk you through this second gym-based routine today. Now, the format for this I'm changing slightly, so please feel free to give some feedback. Just some comments that I've gotten is it's a little bit easier if I just demo the movement, you can press pause, do all the reps on your own, and then return to the video rather than me walking you through the entire thing, specifically for the gym-based routine. So just let me know, give some feedback there. What we're going to do first is the dumbbell incline press. So this is going to work our shoulders and our triceps and our chest. So you're going to lie back on the bench and we're just pressing straight up just like this. So this bench, you can have anywhere in between. This is probably a little bit of a, a lower incline, but you might be able to bring it up one level. So do your one, two or three sets and then come back to the video when you're ready for the next exercise. The next exercise is the dumbbell pullover. So I'm just going to hold one weight. I'm going to be on the bench. We're going to lie back. You can put your feet up on the bench if you'd like. That helps to keep your low back on the bench or you keep your feet down, either is fine. So we're gonna press up right here. This is our end point. And we're gonna go back just like this and pull the weight forward. So this exercise it's gonna work our lat muscles, our shoulder muscles, and our tricep muscles. So do 10 to 12 reps there and come back when you're ready for the next exercise. The next exercise is the standing cable row. So you might have a cable attachment at your gym. And what you're going to do for that is just go ahead and grab a cable. I'm just gonna do one arm at a time. I'll show you a few different angles. And you're going to row in. That is working your back and biceps. Let me show you from this side too so just rowing in just like that so you will do 10 to 12 of those and come back when you're ready for the next one the next exercise is a knee friendly lunge variation you can do this with your own body weight you can hold on to weight too either one's fine we're going to take a step back and instead of doing the lunge like this what we're going to do is keep that position and we're going to lean forward more okay less leg bend and leaning forward more so again We'll do 10 to 12 on left leg, and then you can switch over. Remember the key is leaning forward. That's still gonna get your quads, hamstrings, and glutes, but not putting as much stress on the knee. So that's that forward lean lunge. And when you get done with 10 to 12, get ready for the next one. The next exercise is gonna work your hamstrings, glutes, and back. It's the dumbbell Romanian deadlift. So we're gonna have the weight stay very close to your body. You're gonna push your hips back, keep your back nice and straight. At the top, you're gonna to squeeze your butt. So try not to go into extension like that. And when you go down, try not to be flexed like that. So try to keep your back nice and straight. So we will go 10 reps there. And we have one more exercise left uh, to finish. And it's a core exercise. The last exercise, you can do this on a bench, you can do this on the floor, but it is the dead bug with a weight. So I'm gonna just lie back on this bench gonna hold the weight right here. I'm gonna let it go back just slightly, then the legs go up to 90 degrees, and out one leg at a time. And when you do this, try your hardest to keep your low back pushed onto the floor. And again, you can do this two or three times, and once you're done, you're all set for the day.